Your next job interview might be with an AI agent. The name of the company is Talently AI, and they claim that they're your AI interviewer. An AI interviewer that conducts live conversational interviews and gives real-time evaluations to effortlessly identify top performers. Say goodbye to manual screening and hello to smarter recruiting. Let's watch their demo, and I want to break this down and talk about it. The conventional hiring route is a ticking time bomb of schedules, an avalanche of applications, and a maze of coordination. It's about time we steer towards a smarter, faster, and unbiased hiring experience. Meet Talently.ai, your AI-powered interviewer, designed to simplify, streamline, and supercharge your hiring process. From In general, I'll say the hiring process is fairly broken. I think interviewing is definitely a big part of that. When you go into an interview, you don't really know what to expect. There are a lot of inherent biases that are built into people that just come through in an interview. And so are you really getting a fair shake? Now, having said that, would I rather have an AI actually doing the job and evaluating me solely on whatever characteristics are built in to that large language model that's powering it? I don't think so, but let's see the rest. From tech wizards to marketing gurus, Talently is an expert at conducting live interviews for any role under the sun. Setting up is a breeze with Talently. Just add your job title, detailed job description, and select the interview format. Once your job is live, just share Talently's interview link with candidates. No more back and forth scheduling. Candidates can interview on their own time using the link. Okay, now this is particularly cool. You don't have any more scheduling, so you can just send out a link to one of the candidates and then they just grab it whenever they want. You don't have to block off time on your calendar. Anybody that's gone through from a managerial perspective and interviewed people knows that it is such a big time commitment from setting up the calendar invites to actually managing it and then going through with the interview and then doing the follow-ups afterwards. One of the really powerful things I could see here is just doing the initial screening even with this because that initial phone screening oftentimes is done by a recruiter or somebody who doesn't really have the technical expertise in some cases to know if a person is qualified for the job or not. So this might be able to get to the bottom of that quicker and funnel more qualified candidates to you easier. Imagine being the candidate receiving the Talently interview link. Let's exp Yeah, imagine being the candidate receiving the Talently link and being freaked out that an AI agent is actually handling the interview. I think once you start losing that personal human touch, it's kind of scary because you realize as the interviewee that everything's up to this AI agent. It has nothing to do with uh, a human or making that connection with somebody that you would traditionally have in a job interview. That would be kind of terrifying. Explore a live demo to experience the interview process. What programming languages and frameworks are you most comfortable with for AI development and why? So yeah, for me, I'm most comfortable with Python due to the community support that you receive and the extensive libraries, especially for AI and machine learning. Just like a human interviewer, Talently engages in a seamless conversation making the candidate comfortable while evaluating responses in real time. Let's switch gears and ex evaluating responses in real time. It's kind of cool because you can see how the person's performing. It's also, again, kind of terrifying as an interviewee that you know that this AI agent is just sort of watching every single move you make to see if you make any mistakes or give off any strange signals throughout the process. Explore a live coding interview. Write a function in Python that takes a list of integers as input and returns the second largest number in the list. With Talently, candidates can demonstrate their coding skills in real time, while the AI evaluates their logic, syntax, and problem-solving skills on the go. So I want to hear from any developers out there, anyone who's gone through live coding challenges. I have them in the product side, so we get to talk more theoretical in nature. But if you've gone through a live coding challenge, I'm curious in the comments below if this would make you more comfortable or less comfortable overall. On the one hand, it's kind of cool that there's seemingly maybe less pressure because you don't have a human over your shoulder kind of watching you make mistakes. But at the same time, you do have this AI agent that's watching your coding and syntax and logic and reasoning all sort of in real time and evaluating every single one of those things throughout the process. Oh. Post-interview, the company will receive an extensive evaluation and a precise score for every applicant, simplifying the decision-making process. 
kind of scary that in the future, we're all going to come down to a number. We're going to have a score and that's going to evaluate us based on our performance. There's no other intangible thing that you can apply to that. So I don't know. That's kind of interesting to think about. By evaluating candidates solely based on their responses, Talently removes bias from the get-go, ensuring that only the most qualified individuals are shortlisted. I do like this. I think being the most qualified candidate for a job sometimes can get glossed over because somebody, not just biases, I don't think that's the biggest part, but I think uh, just personality types, things like that. Sometimes you're not yourself in a job interview. Maybe you're extra nervous for some reason. So again, it comes down to, does this make somebody feel more comfortable in a job interview or less comfortable in a job interview? We're all sort of used to interacting with computers and machines on a regular basis, but is AI different in that it feels like it's a human much more than uh, say some sort of form that you're filling out or something else? Talently is able to interview thousands of candidates on its own, shortlisting them, enabling hiring at scale like never before. With Talently.ai, the numbers speak for themselves. 60% time saved per hire, two times increase in recruiter productivity, 4.9 star rating on G2 reviews, 10 times cheaper than human interviewers. Yes, you- Watch out recruiting teams. This is directly coming for you. You heard that right. Talently.ai not only streamlines your hiring process, but also saves you time and resources like never before. AI-powered interviews, human-powered decisions. Talently. All right, so I'm somewhat joking with that last comment of it coming to replace the recruiter's job. What I'm curious is if this really is just an augmentation tool, so something that allows a recruiter to do maybe 10 times, 20 times their normal workload. If so, that's pretty cool. But does it also mean that you only need one recruiter for a company or perhaps even no recruiters and you just have somebody less technical or non-technical that's able to facilitate this AI tool? I think that's going to be the question going forward with all of these AI tools in the workplace. You can imagine a time when this is going to be applied to not just the job interview process, but also managerial decisions, whether or not you get a raise or a bonus going forward, and whether you get to keep your job overall. These are no longer things that we can just speculate about. It's here, it's here now. And I think it's really interesting and fascinating. And I'm curious to see how this actually plays out in person, how this actually integrates within businesses and how people interact with it. And if it makes the job interview process better or maybe a little worse. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. As always, I'm Brian Lovett. This is All Your Tech AI. We'll see you next time. I'm the virtual prophet in the tech town Breaking down AI, wearing the crown From basics to complex, never let you down All your tech AI, earning the renown